Fitbits help let you know if you've hit your step count for the day and can help you keep track when hitting the gym. But this time, it could play a major role at the murder trial of George Birch of Green Bay. NBC 26's Max Grossfeld has the story. Mo Birch is accused of killing 31-year-old Nicole Vander Hayden of Bellevue last May. Now, his lawyers say it wasn't Birch, but Vander Hayden's ex-boyfriend. The state argues evidence from the ex-boyfriend's Fitbit would disprove that argument. Now the court will have to decide whether that evidence is admissible. The prosecution claims it's not expert evidence and shouldn't be held to the same scrutiny. The defense argues it is and it's unreliable. There are multiple pending civil lawsuits um, claiming that Fitbit is not reliable um, for a variety of reasons. Um, so in essence, the defense doesn't think the data is reliable, and we don't think that's something the jury should hear. Also in court today, the medical examiner presented her opinion. Vander Heiden was sexually assaulted around the time of the attack. The doctor also said the victim died from either strangulation or being hit in the head. She said it's just impossible to know which injury caused the death, saying they could have happened at the same time. Reporting live, Max Grossfeld, NBC 26.